Pro-freedom Baloch activists across the globe continue to advocate to their best to highlight the human rights violations by Pakistan in southwestern Balochistan province. However, their efforts seem to have fallen on deaf ears of the Pakistani establishment. As Pakistan continues to pay no heed to atrocities on Baloch people in southwestern Balochistan province, pro Baloch activists say their struggle to highlight the issue will continue. The Balochistan issue has recently gained momentum in the international forum. However, Baloch activists are worried that indifference on its people continues at the hands of the Pakistani establishment. Any genocide, any Baloch activist Noordin Mengal said that another reason why the Baloch people are being targeted by Pakistan is because of the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor or CPEC. We have seen um, an enormous uh, number of disappearances that have taken place only in this year. Uh, the reason for this is because all these people uh, have been a voice against uh, these projects uh, or uh, projects to to eliminate the Baloch people uh, and, and uh, they've been very vocal about it and for that reason Pakistan is carrying out greater human rights abuses. Mengal said that Baloch leadership has made efforts to talk for a solution to bring peace in the province but Pakistani establishment seems least interested. Countless efforts made on behalf of the Baloch leadership to uh, to show that they they're willing to talk uh, for a solution uh, to bring peace in this region, but Pakistan doesn't seem to be interested. The Baloch have taken part in parliamentary elections. The result has been that their governments have been dismissed. Uh, Pakistan does not is not even ready to talk to an elected government of Balochistan. So forget about it talking to any uh, leadership. Baloch activists allege that Pakistan has been using forces to subdue the voices of Baloch people. They have been staging protests across the globe against the human rights violations and unlawful abductions by the Pakistani forces in the region.